It's for Ron with the free kick. David Beckham captaining Manchester United for the first time. Very proud moment for him. He'll want to be a winning captain too. So first to try and support him today. Freund in ahead of Veron. Jonsson in quickly. It's congested in those midfield areas early on. That's Anderton. Wants to count that, I'm sure he will. Corner was aimed towards Blanc. Comfortably cleared by Poyet. Picked up by Freund. in those midfield areas, so Nicky Butt tries to give it some width to Beckham, his captain today. Last two in the Premiership, looking for their third successive win over Manchester United at White Hart Lane. Not too many sides will try and do that this season. Seeger, rather, who was making the run forward from left wing back. Just have to come from behind again. Big on. Van Nistelrooy. Free kick. Whipped in. Richards, the goal scorer with the header away. Can he sport score against Spurs again? Off the wall. Gary Neville. Fairly congested again for United, though. Beckham tried to find Van Nistelrooy. Not a very good start for them. That, Mr. Crowan, is a bit of an understatement. Yeah, it's a bit of an understatement, you're right. Now they what the centre half doesn't even have to jump up in the air ahead of the first one in and try to play offside and get caught again. Fabian Barthez, who had no chance with either goal, finds Beckham to butt. Way out. What's Beckham going to do here? He's going to hit it, of course. And Sullivan watched it all the way. Well, he hit it well. Like that little bit too far out. It's a great strike. But the goalie does well. Veron might just be the man to take over that mantle. Beckham cropping up on the left-hand side. Jonsson. For pace as well, if we can get a goal. Beckham's delivery. Eight, considering when he hasn't played international football, eight point one million pounds. He's playing a small slice of it back already. This Beckham. He's in a central position again. Gary Neville. Nicky Butch still receiving the tension. Cross. Long with the outstretched leg. Nice to Roy. Beckham. Try to find Scun. Away by Gary Neville. Beckham. His last game for United was the final match of last. It was important that he did as well. As you've probably seen. The Spurs fans, one real save to make so far, that from Sabre Veron. Gary Neville. Good ball in, and United immediately reply through Andy Cole. His third goal in four games. I'm sure there were harsh words from him at half-time. That will have been his perfect plan, a goal back straight away. And the England manager too. He's going to deliver. That came off Beckham, and that will be another corner to Spurs. Now Scholes, who's found Beckham. Van Nistelrooy and Solskjaer both streaming forward. Neville finds Beckham. Anderton in to get two goals. The what odds we get right now on that happening. Defensive, deeper midfielder out of the four who went off. Beckham's looking for Solskjaer. Good chance for the Norwegian. And if he gets the full of his head on it, just glances off his head. Not enough to trouble the goalkeeper. A little bit more meat than that, and there would have been a problem. He's very upset. All he knows that was happening. Beckham on Ledley King. It is to be Beckham. 
that wasn't that far away and that is expression from him tells you that it's going away at the left all the time well david's left dear me that wasn't far away it's a tremendous strike well i tell you cole looking for the flick towards van nistelrooy solskjaer's round in this second period they've got that goal can they now score from a set piece plenty of uh, headers in there that comes to deliver Blanc with a header and Laurent Blanc scores for the first time for Manchester United and what's more gets them right back in this game at White Hart Lane 12 minutes into the second half the French World Cup winner scored plenty for his country he's now got one for Alec Ferguson 3-2 well, it's a great header, he gets a little bit of freedom in there, hit Laurent Blanc, and, well, he's not going to miss it that. Sometimes when you don't put a full back in the goal post, which Spurs haven't, you header it in that direction, there's an empty space. Solskjaer wants to get involved. Beckham tees it up, Cole's in there, so too is Van Nistelrooy. Very, very worried Spurs team. Andy Cole has caught a player a little bit like no intention because of the wet side. Beckham sportingly is going to play it back to Neil Sullivan. Beckham for en blanc. Harry Neville has stayed right up on the edge of the Spurs penalty area. This is Beckham. And Nista Roy's touched to Cole. Beckham takes over, wants it on his right foot, goes for it on his left. Well, it's a corner kick. That's it, skipper for the day. We'll take the corner. Again, a what? really good opportunity. Ronnie Johnson, who scored in the... Had he not been booked, I think he probably would have been. Beckham. Yes, it's a great effort by David, coming in on his left foot. His own player, in Teddy Sheringham. Well, it was a great strike by Seagan, his right foot, and he did. That's Freund again, that's another tackle. Cole was looking for Beckham. The King has to play it. David doesn't have to touch him. In the opening 45 minutes to the one we're witnessing in the second quarter. He has one already. It's towards him again. The referee had to either side of him, but Skulls picks it up anyway. Now Beckham. Andy Cole offside. I'm not so sure about it. Off. He's not offside when this ball's... Cr I think there's nothing in that. I don't think he's offside, Steve. Looks level from my replay. Yeah. Logical advantage swings Manchester United's way. Castle, it was 3-3. You just never know with Manchester been uncertain. And if you get a moment, uh, give us a call for the man of the match. 0901 88 treble 2 68. 0901 88. And it's now there's a smile from the manager because they've come from three down to lead 4 3. Well, it might be over, Steve, because I think there's a lot of goals to come. Dare I say it, it's only the team in red that look like in quick succession. That's good battling again from Andy Cole. The referee has waved play on because United have possession. Hopeful from Anderton. Well watched by Jonsson. Oh, lovely from Ruben. Doing it last week, you said, well, a blast it, there was a missed kick. The ball is still in. Beckham against the feet of King. Solskjaer on the turn. And Nista Roy. All three of them waiting for the cross from Beckham. It's too deep, though. Two waiting for the cross. Beckham is there as well. It's David Becker, perhaps one of the truly memorable Premiership matches of recent years and a truly memorable Manchester United victory. Well, Oli does great. A little dummy here gets the ball across the box to David. He's outside the box. You think if he keeps it down, he'll score. Do you remember the conversation I had with his father before the game? I says, David always scores here. Great strike by David. All he's got to do is keep it down. He does. And it's thank you very much. Great strike, David, and your manager of your England team's watching you as well. Poyet's shot was blocked. Yeah, good defending by Ronnie Johnson. Frustrating end to a match at half-time. They must have thought they were going to put in their scrapbooks. Three times away from home and still wins the game. 
and one of the truly magnificent games of recent times brings a smile to Alec Ferguson in the end but at half time it certainly wasn't there at three down he shakes hands with Glenn Hoddle who must be absolutely shell-shocked